but I went to dental school at Case Weston. I lived at a Christian dental fraternity house all the way through school. Now, and it had an impact on me, a favorable impact. Um, um, I was not a member of the fraternity because the bylaws read you had to be Christian in those days, and I wasn't Christian. But they needed, there was a number of older married students and older students, and like any fraternity house, you have to rent a certain number of rooms to survive. So they needed to rent some rooms. So, so I didn't care, I just wanted to live there. You know, I just needed a place to live, and, and I thought it would be good being with other students, and they have labs in the basement, and all that sort of thing. Bunsen and burner things that you didn't have to stay at school overnight, you could take home. So um, I lived there all the way through school, and they became my closest friends my closest friends. One of my very closest friends' father was a evangelical minister in the Bible Belt of um, Ohio, Mansfield, Ohio. You probably don't. It's not too far from Columbus. David Vanessaw was his name. I'm still in my my wife can't believe that these people are still in touch with me. But the point is, they became my closest friends. That's Christian fraternity, and I became one of their closest friends. It did have an impact on me because occasionally they would ask, it was never anti, any anti-Semitism, but I'll give you one. My, my roommate came from a town of 400 people. His father was a farmer. And we would go there when they would tap the maple trees. Uh, when uh, we had a little cubby, uh, we each in the kitchen we had a little cubby hole where you could put cookies and raisins, whatever you want. So when Passover rolled around, I had matzahs in there. And people came over to me, what's that? They had never seen it before. These are people from Ohio, small towns. They had never seen it before. So when I reason I'm telling you this, it made me more aware of my Jewishness because suddenly I had to answer to people that were curious and that didn't know anyone that was Jewish. And here I was like a representative of Judaism. And yet we've all got along extremely well. 